what is going on everybody welcome back to the channel and in this video we are going to be doing a review on the blu-ray edition of the batman this is one of my favorite movies of all time my top five for sure i think this quite possibly could be the greatest superhero movie of all time but also the greatest comic book movie of all time could be it's definitely again in the top five um this movie rocks, man. This movie kicks all kinds of ass. It, it, it's just a perfect story of Batman. And there's no better comic book story than Batman. Because um, there's no better comic book hero than Batman. Um, he, his story is so interesting and so impactful. The only one that comes close is Spider-Man's. And it, it just doesn't hit all the same. Um, so it does come with the Blu-ray edition, the DVD edition. And it comes with a digital code that you have to redeem... Which is already too late to redeem, because I guess I bought the thing too late. This was, you couldn't, it says redeem the code by 6-30-2023. I bought this, like, December. So, <laughs> this is, the, the code's long overdue. I wasn't going to redeem it anyways, because I just want it for the disc, but. Uh, yes, this movie came out in 2022. It is fantastic. I saw it in theaters three times, and I uh, definitely don't regret it. Here's the back. I'll read you what it says. It says, uh, revolutionary electric and exhaling? That must be a typo. Either that or I can't read this crappy handwriting. Oh, that's not an H. That's a T. Exhilarating. Okay. This handwriting so bad. But that is a quote from Sean O'Connell. Um, here's like a little summary of the story. Uh, killer targets Gotham's elite sending the Batman on an investigation as evidence as evidence mounts he must forge new relationships unmask the culprit and bring justice amidst corruption uh over two hours of special features um vengeance in the making a documentary featuring cast and crew deleted scenes which i'm very interested in because i haven't seen any deleted scenes for this film yet um with director's commentary autonomy of the car chase, oh, Anatomy of the Car Chase, sorry, featuring the Batmobile, um, the Batman Genesis, Becoming Catwoman, and more. Again, the digital code you can stream or download to watch anywhere on the Movies Anywhere app. Um, pretty cool. Uh, so here, we'll slide it out of this. Again, the, the case is the same as the, the box. We open it up here. We get the digital code which again means nothing because the fucking thing already ran out. We get three discs. Wow. Three. Right, Cause I haven't opened this yet. I ripped the plastic off and I stuck it on my shelf over there, which by the way, I hope you guys are liking this. I still gotta do a whole review on everything that's going on back here. Cause I've added so much shit. I still haven't gotten around to doing it. I'll get there. I promise. But yeah, we have the Batman. I guess this is the, yeah, this is the Blu-ray edition it's right there. The classic Blu-ray right there very cool cd or disc whatever you want to call it this is the dvd version so this is non-blu-ray and then this is the special features edition all very cool designs um just of dvds i really am digging this riddler one it's very cool would have been nice if it was like batman catwoman riddler um they didn't choose to go that route obviously very nice. I, very, I actually cannot wait to get into this stuff. I still haven't gotten around to doing it. Um, I, I need to watch all these movies. Every DVD I have up here, I have not watched yet, aside from Scream 6 and Cobra Kai Season 5. Those are the only two, out of all the CV, out of all like the DVDs and movies I have, are the only two I've actually... Oh, and The Last of Us. I've, I watched that too. Um... And by watched, I mean, like, took them out of the package, put them in my PlayStation and watched them. I obviously have seen them all, but I still got to get around to watching the rest of them. And this is no exception. Um, the box art for this is just amazing. I still love this, this like, this poster today. Um, it's not too over-designed. There's not too, too much going on. It shows Gotham City, you know, the, the main villains, the Batman himself, and Bruce Wayne. And it's got, like, a like a scope target thing right on them. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini review of this film. Um, 
Again, if you guys have not seen it, definitely recommend you go and watch it. It's a great film. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.